Assalamu alaikum dear friends welcome back to survey designing and so 3d video series by Murad Farooq dear friends today video tutorial in this video tutorial we will be learn how we can control sub assembly part parameters custom parameters and measurement of different parts we will be use this is from the pilot setting and previous videos i already explained with very details the basic of sub assembly composer please like and share the videos and subscribe our channel for more such informative videos let's need to start our topic drag this one like that and from here we need to go to the pocket setting you can see and here we need to go to the input so from here you can see the pocket setting so here you can see these things site and here site input and output and from here we need to enter anything left right if you enter from here this will be automatically go as same like in the seal 3d and from here we need to just click to create a parameters from here and we need to make it to fit to screen to make it in the front and press here and here you can see and from these things this is whole numbers double string rate slope yes and non super elevation you can use this everything and here we need to enter input and here the default value as per our requirement we need and here will be the formal name which one will be displayed in the civil 3d so here we need to enter the name but be careful if you put a space it will be coming wrong don't put a space without space you need to enter the name if you need so here we need to enter len width first of all and here we need to select the double and here we need to enter the width 4 meter and here is the formal name len width okay so now we need to drag here just go to here and make it and fit on screen and just select the top and you can also select this one from the flow chart as you like and here we need to enter the delta x we need to enter the name which one we enter there land width and press enter you can see the measurement and dimension is changed automatically now if you enter the distance how much distance you enter here it will be changed automatically you can see and if we need to enter here two meters it will be changed automatically if we need enter seven meter it will be changed automatically fit to screen so okay we will be create the next parameter from here just enter the name thickness suppose we need to use this one as thickness pavement thickness and here enter suppose 0.5 and here is the formal name pav thickness okay so we need to press enter and need to select this side link here point two and three just click here and here the properties will be displayed you can also select from the flow chart here the delta y we need to enter the name thickness and press the enter from your keyboard you can see the thickness is changed automatically so for the other side we need to again to select and put the name in the properties just select this one and go to the properties and here enter thickness with minus icon thickness and press enter now it will be changed automatically so now if you are coming here to bucket setting and you're changing the delta y it will be changed automatically you can see and if you again change so the value will be changed with the custom properties and measurement like that so the next we need to go to put one parameter again cross slope we need to enter for cross slope here 
and from here we need to change this to the grid and here we need to enter a cross slope suppose we need to enter 5.00 percent and here enter cross slope this so is the formal name which name you're using here it will be displayed automatically on civil three properties and select here the top one line and go to here to the properties and enter the name here in the slope cross slope yes and press enter you can see the slope will be changed automatically if once you press the enter button from your keyboard no we need to change here from the bucket setting the custom setting you can see if you're entering here how much percentage in slope it will be changed automatically suppose we need to enter just to show to you 20 percent it will be change if you need to enter 50 percent it will be change this is just for the example so again it will bring on the default as usual two percent so in the next tutorial we will be learn regarding the target parameters and i will be explain this is with very details so dear students i hope you guys learned from this video we'll see in the next tutorial allah nigahman assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh